Yo! What's up, guys? It's me, your boy. B! Back here on the YouTube channel. Playing some more flipping night in the woods. If you guys are excited, alright? Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, comment. Do all that good stuff for me. Thank you. Much appreciated. Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm a little stun-locked IRL right now. Like, I feel stun-locked IRL. I feel like there's five people that are ganking mid lane, and all of them have a stun ability, and I'm just getting chain-stunned, you know, one after the other. And that's because I literally just woke up, guys. I literally just woke, from, uh, woke up from a nice little nap. So honestly, I just feel kind of like stun locked right now. I feel kind of dazed. But um, hopefully you guys don't mind. I'm pretty sure I'll be good as we can keep, you know, going through with this video. I'll be better as we keep going through with the video. But um, yeah, guys, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate you guys all. Um, Fears the Fathom is coming up after Night in the Woods, okay guys? And it's not because someone freaking listened to me, alright? It's because I freaking just feel like doing it, alright? And because honestly, the Fears the Fathom videos, video got like, oh, what the, this is, this is a dialogue here, up here? But yeah, the Fears of Fathom video did pretty well, so I'm like, screw it, I'll just do it. <laughs> Excuse me, I'll just finish it. So we're gonna do that after. I was gonna play Fears of Fathom right after I finished episode one. I was gonna play some more, but no one flipping commented within the day mark. So we're that's why we're playing Night in the Woods. But someone actually did ended up commenting like two days after that video aired. It was a little bit too late. So sorry for the dude or the lady who commented a little bit too late. All right, but anyways, let's play Night in the Woods. So. If you guys, you know, aren't familiar with what we're playing, we're playing this, like, you know, adventure, mystery, side-scrolling, walking simulator game, video game, um, by the name of Night in the Woods. It's, like, kind of some Animal Crossing kind of vibe. Everyone's, like, an animal and shit. Um, and we play as Mae Borowski right here, the main character, our protagonist. And right now, not much is going on. Um, I will say one thing that I didn't like about this game is that there is no voice dialogue. There, or there's no like voice acting in this game. So everything is consumed. Like every sort of like dialogue is consumed via just reading. So that's one thing that I had a problem with. It's not like the biggest issue, but I personally am not a big fan of it because I just feel like if you don't have voice acting in like a video game like this, like I just feel like it really breaks away from the immersion of the game. And it kind of like, you know, it's it's it just you know I feel like having a voice actor is just much better in in, in like you know um, conveying emotions of a character and stuff like that and like their personality traits and you know all that stuff you know and also just adds to the immersion, but. That's one of my big. <clears throat> that's after playing this game for about an hour. That was one of my biggest gripes. But um, yeah, I don't really know too much about the story so far. But there is supposed to be some sort of mystery uh, within the woods. So um, we're gonna go hopefully figure out maybe the beginning of that ish today. So let's go ahead and you know, just interact with the world around us, my friends. All right, let's do this thing. Boom. I remember the time in ninth grade. When I snuck out and could see into Tom Bramwell's room. Oh, okay. Maze little peeping Tom vibe. You little pervert. What the? Oh my god, she's staring at ass. She's staring at ass cheeks, yo. In the ninth grade, May, you little horny. You little horn dog. Yep, that sure did happen. Okay. <clears throat> So, I was confused in the beginning of this game, because I was like, oh, this is going to be like a kid's game. But there's actually, like, cursing in this game, and there's, like, this kind of shit in this game. Straight up freaking, you know, two-dimensional ash cheeks in your face. Like, freaking... So, you know, I was pleasantly surprised that there are adult themes in this game. So, it's, it's, it's a nice balance between, like, you know, children and, like, adult. All the road work crammed in before winter. Wait, what did she say before? Makes like half the town inaccessible, unless you want to walk the walk the long way around for like 20 minutes. Which I mean, no. So 
There's a lot of construction going on within um, Possum Springs. So it looks like, you know, they're kind of like upgrading. They're hitting the they're hitting the industrial revolution type ish, you know. Hey Mr. Twigmire. So we are, we already met Mr. Twigmire in the last video. And I guess I guess um because there's no like um load files, um we have to redo this again. So it's unfortunate. Yeah, we have to do it again. Sure is. You home for a visit? No, I'm home for good. What, they don't have college anymore? Nope, oh yeah, and then this again. Nope, it burned down, and then not for me at least. We picked not for me at least in the last video. Let's just stay true with our decisions. I always thought you'd either go on to do, I always thought you'd either go on to do great things or sit on your ass here until it put down roots. Ass roots. Guess I can settle that one in my mind. Okay, that's a little strange. See you around, dot dot dot. Yeah, this man's yeah, everyone's thinking about ass today. May was thinking about ass, Mr. Twigmire's thinking about ass roots. What the hell is going on? Oh what the the squirrel like got scared away. Did you guys see that? So we have, you know, a nice little dainty little town. Possum Springs. It looks very lively. Everyone's out and about doing their, you know, their errands. Just enjoying a nice, lovely day here at Possum Springs. Alright, let's go. Let's go. So I think we're still in, like, chapter one. Okay! So here we have our first little, you know, our gaming section. We're gaming, guys. I'm gaming. So we got ourselves a little bear here, I think. Is that our dad? Is that Pops? Can't interact with him. So we got a little bear here. Let's just go ahead and vibe out with this dude. Selmers, what are you doing home? Dropped out. Wow. Yeah, I guess. So, like, you just don't go back? That's about it. Weird. So, how have you been? Okay. Me and Dennis split. Oh, no. Wait, what's this person's name? Selmer or something like that? Yeah, he got a job at the new prison over in Brittle. And he met some girl at a gas station. Dang, that it, it, he, he, he dumped her over a girl from a gas station? What the hell? They must have had the worst relationship, dude. Wow, what a jerk. Eh, he's a free agent. I guess. What's that word they use for, like, a weapon you make in jail? I think they called it the freaking Glock Dookie, right? <laughs> Is, am I am I tripping? Isn't that they, what they call the Glock Dookie in jail? I don't, I don't know. Like a knife? I don't think they call it a knife though. A shiv? I hope Dennis gets shivved at work. Yo, chill. Just to scare him. Scare him good. Yo, Selmers. That do it? What? Scare him right in the kidney? Okay, well, I gotta go. Nice seeing you. Stop by any time. I don't know if I'm gonna be stopping by after after you just basically freaking premeditated someone's freaking murder, freaking psycho ass. Alright, let's go talk to this guy. These guys. Oh, the little pigeons move too. I like that. Oh, okay, we can do something here, watch. We're gonna we're gonna game I'm gaming here, guys. This is what you guys are here for. Professional singer single player gamer here, right? Look at that. You see that? We're gaming. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, what the? You can actually go across? Oh, and you press down jump like in Super Smash Bros. So you can go through. Okay. Alright, let's talk to the bird guy. We, there's no new dialogues with Selmers. I think that's what her name was, Selmers. Her ass is crazy. Hello. Watch your doing on my porch. Oh, he don't like that we're on here. Hey, Mr. Chazokov. Hello, May. My best worst student. Oh, it's our teacher? Haha, <laughs> yeah. Like the constellations. Hated school. What? Hey, don't knock school. School is vital for your future. What are you doing at back in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Ironically. Oh. Well, if you're still interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should have my new telescope set up by then. Okay. 
What was this guy's name again? Stars. Oh, look at that. You can see that, guys? A little star action. I like that. We might have to stop by this dude's house um, later. Hopefully he's not on some Selmer's vibe where he's trying to freaking, like, hurt people. What was this dude's name again? Dude, that's the thing about, like... That's the thing about, like, with the, just only having text dialogue. I, I, I forget the name fast as fuck. You know? Excuse my language, but... It would have been much easier for me to remember something if, like, someone was saying it in my ear, you know? But that's just me. Oh, here we go. We got some We got some gaming action here. We're gaming. What is this? We got a little cat in the background with, like, a, a gravestone? That looks creepy. Okay, so the town looks great, by the way. Ta Possum Springs looks great. So far. I'm digging it. Uh, what's this? I remember when B's family had a house and not a tiny depressing apartment. Okay. So maybe they're... Someone's not doing as, you know, financially good as they were. B, she's noticing that B is going broke. Hey, it's the Harleys. What are you doing? Little Joe, you're under arrest. Oh, wow. Kids still talk about Little Joe? We used your DNA. Do you kids know what DNA is? Ghosts don't have DNA. What? Ghosts don't have DNA? I don't know, let's just be fun, right? Yeah, ghosts don't have DNA, loser. Hey, lady, can you leave us alone? Yeah, leave us alone, lady. Lady? Alright. They just want to play by themselves. Okay, we got a little cat, a little 2.5 dimensional cat drinking some coffee. You seeing that? Alright, let's talk to the homie. Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was a freshman. Probably. How's it going? Just lost my job. Oh no. They say construction's always hiring. But it's not. In fact, it's often laying off guys named Dan. Oof. What are you going to do? I'm open to suggestions. Don't give up. I'm sure someone in town is hiring. I'll just say, don't give up. Well, there's always a chance someone will die. What? And I can have their job? Dan, you're not gonna, like, kill anyone, are you? Does it pay? Um, okay, I'm assuming they're joking. I don't have a job either. Oh, man, sorry to talk about your ear off. T sorry to talk your ear off about it. How are you holding up? Good, just dropped out of college and I'm living with my parents. Oh, so you're basically a teenager again. No. I'm just an adult living with her parents. Oh, okay, so it's not like you're unemployed. It's like you're lacking a daytime hobby that pays money you don't need for rent. All right, I'm gonna get going. Yeah. <clears throat> a lot of assholes here, not gonna lie. Danny's a straight asshole. I mean, he just got laid off, I guess. So, I mean, I guess it would make sense why he's a, being an asshole right now. Bird guy is kind of strange. He don't like talking to no one. And that freaking bear chick is going crazy. This was the only chill dude. And I forgot his name. He was our teacher, though. Jeez, you know, it looks like these guys, not no one's not no one's really friendly, eh? No one's really got that friendly vibe. Alright, so we're here just, you know, chilling in Possum Springs. Let's let's see what's this. What's this? Oh, we got it. We look at look at our hand. Ding ding. Look at that. Look at that. See our hand moving? Excuse me. Ding, 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 ding. All right. Scrapbooking Odyssey. Um, there's an address. Katie Washington has never lost a child. Can't read that too well. Tim's landscaping, firewood for sale. We can move this around. So, missing. Come on, let's, let's push it over here. Missing Casey Hartley, 19, of Possum Springs. Last seen at dusk on June 27th, walking westward along the tracks behind the former food donkey. He 
was wearing a black hooded sweatshirt, jeans, and black canvas shoes. If you have any information as to the location of Casey Harley at any time since his last known sighting, please contact the Possum Springs Police Department immediately. So it looks like there's a missing person here in Possum Springs. That's pretty sketch. You know, because missing persons basically means... You know, after around a month or so of a person missing, someone got freaking murdered, you know what I'm saying? So, oh, it's not looking good here. This might be the mystery that we have on our hands. Possum Springs? More like Awesome Springs? They, how old are these guys? How old is the government? Oh, well, that's just patronizing. Why would... Who would leave this here? Yeah, let's, let's yoink this... Let's yoink the yarn ball. Oh, man, it bounces. Can we keep it? Wow, look at the physics. They got some actual physics going on here in gravity. Alright, harvest. Uh, Possum Springs annual harvestacular. Celebrate the fall colors with your neighbors. Rides, contests, foods, games, and annual crazy costume parade. October 21st, 24th, the town center. Sponsored by Possum Springs Chamber of Commerce. Blessed restaurant parlor. Cat Trosser and Cat Trosser attorneys. And Ham Panther. Oh, okay. Uh, how do I exit out? OV. Okay. What's in here? Oh, we have um like a um like a subway station. Usually someone fishing here for tunnel fish because why the hell not? The tunnel flooded and we lost a bit more land to the fish. What? Trolley side news? Pretzels and pierogies. Hey, I just got back in town and the one thing I missed most was... Hey, I remember you. Hello. Thief! Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Alright, you know what? I'm not a thief. You take that back. This isn't even a restaurant, so you can only two, you can only pick between two negative choices. Uh, we're just gonna... I'll just go with the first option. I'm not a thief. This isn't even a restaurant. I don't know. I'm not a thief. I have stolen from better places than this. I wouldn't lower myself to steal from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. Okay, yeah, like, the people in, um, Delicious Pretzels, the people in Possum Springs are, you know, for the most part, they're all pretty mean, not gonna lie. Oh, wow, look at the murals in the background. Oh, shoot, yeah, we got some freaking gang activity going on. Oh, dang, yo. Look at the mural in the background, though. This is sick. Oh, we need to start taking thumbnail pictures, too. Oh, and then there's the exit here. Ah, I see. The music might be a vibe. Hold on. Let me turn that up a little bit. And what the hell is this journal, bruh? This is a 19-year-old girl. Why? Like, see, this is what doesn't make sense. This is not what a 19-year-old girl is supposed to be drawing. And, like, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, I don't know, but... This is, like, what five, seven-year-old, eight-year-olds do. Like, look at this. Like, what? I'm convinced. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Dad looks older. Like, what is this? How the hell do you draw a space dragon? Yeah, my character is like freaking dumb or something. I don't know. Alright, well, let's talk to these delinquents. Hey, teens. Hey. What are you guys doing? Oh, well, this might be a little thumbnail here. Let's take a thumbnail. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Nothing. Cool. Cool that people still hang around down here. We used to do that when I was in high school. Yeah. I wasn't in high school that long ago, you know. How old are you? 20? Oh, so you can't buy beer. No. Do you have a car? 
No. Hmm. Okay, that was it. See, that's what I'm saying. How are we a 20 year old? And what the hell is this? This is what 20, like, this is not what 20 year olds are doing. This is not what, this is like, some child shit right here. Alright. I might be judging too soon, let's keep playing. So this isn't like a, I thought this was like a train station, but this is like a river down here. What the heck? Let's go back up here, because I don't want to skip anything. Here we go. Town center platform? What? It's a freaking... Oh, she's pregnant, I think. Look at this lady. Construction? Yeah. My god, what kind of weather did I miss? This is nuts. Oh well, I wasn't going to church anyways. We wrote something in our notebook? My god. What kind of- oh, it just says the same thing. Thought this place is falling apart? Fat pocket pawn? Look at this guy. Look at this old little geezer guy. What? And where exactly are you planning on going? I don't know. And Panther? No, let's just, let's just, I don't feel like reading it. I've been hearing a lot about murdering people, like, what's going on? Freaking Selmer in the beginning wanted to shank some, shank her ex? Freaking... Danny over here is talking about freaking killing people. Like, what the hell? I mean, I guess it makes sense because they're animals. There's a lot of like murder themes going on, like violence themes going on in, in this in this video game. Looks like these guys are married. And then she's going to. I wasn't really paying attention. She's going to work or something like that. She's gonna murder somebody. I don't know. Coffee, cigarette. Yeah, these guys are strange. All right, but Possum Springs really cool. Town center family practice. Oh wow, look at that. So it looks it looks like we have like the um the the town center or whatever you want to call it. Should you trying to get as close to the mouse as possible without procking that? Yeah. This is probably gonna be the thumbnail. Let's get one without without anything in it. I wanna get some I wanna get the car in it. There we go. So, in this world, we have human animals, and then we have regular animals. We've seen squirrels, you see this raccoon right here. And it looks like they probably can't talk, I think. Maybe that will come into play later. I don't know. Alright, let's talk to this mouse guy. Hey, killer. Yeah, what the hell? What do you mean? See, what's going on, man? This thing is, everyone's talking about killing people, shanking people up. We got delinquents hanging out in the freaking, the freaking uh, sewers or whatever we were at. The freaking like underground river or whatever. Oh, I think it was, it, every, this this town is giving me a strange vibe. It's like so beautiful, but like something you know dark and sinister is going on. Ah! <laughs> no, I'm good. We're good, guys. Hey, killer. Uh, don't call me that. Who are you, Lori M? How do you even know about the killer thing? What? It was a big deal even to us middle schoolers. Yeah, well that was a long time ago. And what did the middle schoolers say? You put him in the hospital. What? Wait, we're a... What happened? Yo, May is... She's violent? And no one knows why. Did he like have it coming or something? No. Our mothers told us not to talk to you. Okay. Okay. Because no one knew when you were going to do it again? Well, say hi to your mom for me. She sounds lovely. Oh, she's gone. 
Oh, shit, sorry. It's fine. Yeesh. R.I.P. So, we have this interesting story here. So, you know, during the time when either May was in, like, high school or something like that, she got into this altercation with someone that put them in the hospital, and everyone in the school knew about it, and all these rumors were spreading around, everyone's parents were telling all their children to not hang out with May Borowski because of that incident. Jeez. So, we don't have a good reputation around here. As far as I'm concerned. Let's see what the statue is. I think I have a great great uncle or something on this. Yep, there you go. Anselm Borowski. Oh, her uh, great uncle's great great uncle's uh, name is engraved in this. Anselm? Even in life, he was tragic. We like our moments in... We like our war moments in Possum Springs. There are two really ancient ones over in Old Possum Springs. Three in town proper. And I think they put a new one up on Pill Hill. There's one by Possum Jump, but that one's spooky. I haven't been up there since that party. We're not going to think about. Oh, so it looks like Possum Springs had gone through some wars. And it looks like... May's ancestor was a part of the war. You see that the statue of the soldier up here? Okay, so there's a war that happened here. Uh, let's go here. What's here? <laughs> Excuse me. Video Outpost 2. 2? Is that like 2? Or, or like also? This is an error so bad, even I wouldn't make it. Also, where was the other video outpost? Yeah, if it's video outpost 2, where's video outpost 1? Postability, Social Security Administration. We might have to go back. Oh, no we don't. Because that leads here. I was going to say the sewer. We have to go to the sewer. The town center platform, but yeah, this is where the um, the other staircase leads. Yeah, here we have the little delinquents here. So we it is like some sort of train system. Like there's like ferries here that they ride, but it's like seems like no one's. It's like not an under op. It's not like being operated or anything. No one's doing anything. So this guy looks high as shit. You see that? He's got the red eyes. Miller's looks like this is like a bar. It's almost five. Quitting time. Kick back some brews and watch the smelters. Okay. Oh, we got a little super jump here. Let's do it, baby. We messed that one up. We gotta start, like, right here. Okay, well, there's an invisible wall right there. What the hell? What the hell? Let's try this way. No, 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 not here. Let me go like right here. Ah! I wanted to make it on top of there. Alright, no. There's no way to get on top of this, like, power line up there. Oh, we can go inside here. What's this called? The Snack Falcon or something like that? Snack to school? Welcome to Possum Springs, Snack Falcon. Alright, we could take- this might be the thumbnail here. Have a great day. I'm just reading the little like sign up there. Welcome to Possum Springs. That'll be good. Snack Falcon. Oh my god. Hey Greg. What are you doing here? I'm back. Like back as in today? Back as in back. Too bad you didn't die at college. Yo, what's up with all these like dying themes in this game? Man, what the hell? Too bad you didn't catch a flesh-eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda machine accident. God, it's good to see you. What the hell? Who talks that? What the hell? I Man, get your fucking Beavis and Butthead, freaking Forrest Gump, freaking... This dude, Spongebob looking ass. Man, dude is getting too excited to see me. How's Angus? You two still a thing? Hold on. 
What are you doing? Changing the music. Okay, we're going with a little more like jazzier theme. What? Angus! What are you doing here? This guy is clearly excited to see me. I live here. Since when? Since last night? 11 or so? That's amazing. Come to band practice. Oh my god, the band is still a thing? Sure. When's practice? Now. When do you get off work? Now. Really? Oh my god. Ah, uh, what? What the hell is going on? Greg rules. Dude. Are we 10 years old or are we 20? What is the age? What is our age? What is everyone's age? Is this, this guy 10 or is he 20? The hell? Thought Big skeleton? What, what does that mean? Are we missing notes? Alright, let's go. Hi, Angus. Oh, here's Angus. Hey, it's you. It's May. It's May. Ah. So the party barn went out, huh? Yeah, not sure how it even stayed open. Like, how many parties are there, really? You need a lot of parties to keep a barn running. I have your old base. Oh, dude, I don't think I rem even remember. Hey, B, uh, May's back. Dot, dot, dot. Wow, hi. Yeah, hi. She's totally back. Wait, what? Are you, uh, here for band practice? I play drums. That's not drums. That's computer. It's fine. She also does your bass parts. Well, I understood them as the bass parts, but I can turn them off. Turn them off on your computer? May, we're totally gonna play a song. You totally have to play bass. I don't even remember. Those aren't even drums. Oh shit. Die anywhere else? What's up with all this dying shit? I'm f I effed up already. Right, here we go. We're, we're, we're gaming here. So we're just having a little jam sesh here with the homies. Um. It's chill. It's got some like, you know, some like 90s like freaking arcade vibes. I gotta f I'm locking in right now. I'm locking in. Oh shit! Oh! That one goofed up. I, my brain freaking farted there. There we go. What the hell is going on right now? Okay, are we gonna get like star power? Can we get like star power like in the regular Guitar Hero? Or just no? I'm guessing not. And there's the lyrics coming on the screen, but like I can't read the lyrics so I gotta focus on the hitting the notes. But there are some lyrics. I wish I could read them. But I gotta jam out, you know? Oh shit, what the hell? Oh! Oh my god, that was kinda hard. Okay, I kind of like the beat to this though, not gonna lie. Okay. Uh, I was trying to remember what the name B was from. I remember reading something about it, I forgot though. Alright, that was pretty chill, that was pretty chill. Yeah, that was okay. Not bad considering I don't know this song. Holy crap, that was hard to do. You'll get back in you'll get back in practice. I hope. Jeez, my wrist hurts. That was great, man. Like just seeing you back. 
playing your old horrible bass. Okay, are we doing this diner thing? Yeah! Woo! Yay. Hip hip. What? Uh, writing could use some work. Hell yeah. Did you miss pizza, May? They have pizza at school? Oh, cool. Okay. This pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Dudes, haven't you heard of the pizza scale? The what? Screw it. Pizza good. The what? What's a pizza scale? There's a scale of pizza. On one end, there's the worst pizza, but like everything right above that is still really good. What's at the other end of the scale? It's pizza all the way up. Pizza good. Give me that freaking slice, mother effer. Dang, he can't even reach it. He can't reach it. Mmm, I miss pasta abilities. I am not touching those crusts. Same. We should have gone to pasta abilities. The diner has ambiance. The seats are comfy. The food is terrible, but it's got a ch it's got charm. You too fancy for the diner now, guys? Please. I was raised in this diner. You and like a zillion rats. Okay, so when are we gonna play out? What? Snort May. We don't play out. Oh, we have jobs, May. I work at the video outpost, too. I'm at the old pickaxe. I thought you were going to school. Isn't that your dad's store? Um, I'll just say I thought you were going to school. I don't know. Heh. <laughs> yeah, well, life happens. I'm Lord of the Snack Falcons. The heck? Who is this guy? This guy's like freaking... This guy's definitely on the spectrum or something. Where's Casey? Oh yeah, you wouldn't know, huh? Oh yeah, Casey went missing. Casey Hartley or whatever. Casey's gone. We gotta be a little serious here. Gone? Gone how? Hop the train, I bet. Oh wow. He always talked about doing that. Yeah, one day, he was just gone. Made a clean break. Hasn't emailed or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters. But everyone knew what happened. Jeez, Casey, I... Huh. Hmm. And what exactly do you do, May? I was in college. And why exactly are you not still there? Man, screw school. Didn't work out. What did say didn't work out? Huh. Imagine that. Dot, dot, dot. What? Well, but what? Well, we better get home, dude. Oh yeah, Angus got a date with sword people online. What the hell, sword people? All oh, lucky. Lucky? What does that even mean? It's really great to be back, dude. We can hang out every day. Oh my god, holy crap! What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first. What? What the hell? What just happening? Ugh, I'm going to have to start worrying about getting dismembered on my way home. Shh, I want to watch this. You don't need your ears to watch. Shh. Ugh. Damn, there's a little cockroach here. Kill the shot. I killed the cockroach. Ah. Uh. It's fast. Oh, here we go. I want to kill the cockroach. Ah! Oh, we can't kill it. What is this? Whoa, what's that? Some kind of mark. What? Is that a tattoo? That's a tattoo. What is it? I think you just sleuth out a clue, dude. Oh, for F's sake, you two. Here come the cops. Now what's going on here? Uh-oh. Hey, it's our aunt. Hey, Aunt Molly, we found an arm. All right, May, put the stick down and step away from the arm. How is everyone so, like, nonchalant, so, you know, happy-go-lucky about seeing a dismembered arm? Like, is it because they're animals and they're used to that? I, I don't know. All right, all right, don't taser me or anything. No promises. Oh, well, I think it's time for Angus and I to get home. See you tomorrow, May.
Alright, I don't want any of you walking home alone tonight. Buddy system, something bad's going on. I can drive May home, officer. Thank you, B. Yeah, thanks, B. Let's roll. What? Oh, this is a cool image. So. Working at the old pickaxe. Yep. Are they training you to take over the family business? They? Um, your parents? Dot dot dot. Hey, look. We're here. Oh, my house actually isn't for a few blocks. Get out. Okay. Uh, thanks for the ride. Go. What? Yo, are we about to- are we about to start having- are we about to start freaking turn-based combat in this game? What the hell? Die anywhere else. Gregory's Pizza Scale. Too fancy. Good as hell. And then avoid the heck? Arm tattoo. It was chopped, severed. Army jacket? On the sidewalk. What? Dude, what is going on? Oh, what the fuck? What is going on? Hey, kitten. Rawr. Listen, May, I'm sorry about last night. I really thought you were coming home tonight. It's okay. It's okay, I guess. It's okay. Went through the ravine by the old mill. Almost died. What? Yeah, logs almost killed me. Normal stuff. Well, I promise you'll, you, I'll never leave you stranded again. Tell you what, how about we pretend I did come home tonight and we just got back from the bus station. Start over? Yeah, okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, May, thanks for picking me up. Welcome home, May. I'm going to go to sleep, I think. Well, you've had a big day. Good night, kid. We're not even going to tell our dad about the severed arm that we just saw? Oh, wait, if I, okay, here we go. There, I was about to say, like, what the hell? We found an arm on the ground today. Are we still pretending it's yesterday? No, we came out to the click-clack and there was an arm. Just like, an arm? What? Aunt Mall Cop came and everything. Oh my god, that's really weird. I poked it with the stick. Okay, really, May, don't poke dead body parts with sticks. Too late. Wow, I'll have to email Molly. Alright, good night for real now. You see, that's what I'm saying. Like, how are, how is May acting so, like... Dude, someone might be dead. And she's like, I poked it with a stick. Ha <laughs> ha. Like... She's 20 years old. How is she... Is, is my character, like, st stupid or something? Like, does she not have any feelings towards, you know, people dying? Like, does she not care about if someone's dying? What the hell is wrong with my character? I'm not liking the writing. I'm not liking the writing. It's like, you know, May should be, like, I understand May is like this very immature, you know, carefree, just doesn't freaking realize, she couldn't freaking, you know, she couldn't freaking spot a freaking, you know, a freaking, like, she couldn't freaking spot a freaking, a freaking, Something standing right in something freaking sitting right in front of her. Like, what's going on with my character? Like, why is she acting like this? Like, why is like she just see a dead arm, a dead bot, dead like a freaking body part, and then she's just like, I poked it with a stick. He 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 he. Like, what do you mean? Like, what? what? Okay, and we learn die anywhere else. Okay, no, we're not playing a song. No, screw that. We're going to sleep. Bedtime? Wait, 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 wait. Can we leave? Let me see if we can leave the house. We can't. So then what's the point of... Alright, I'm done. I'm done. This game is upsetting me. This game is really upsetting me. The writing in this game... This does not sound like a bunch of college, or, you know, a bunch of college kids. This sounds, these guys sound like high schoolers. 
It's one gripe. Another gripe I have with this game is the writing. Writing is not the best. But we are finally introduced to some sort of conflict, although it doesn't really feel like it's a conflict because our main character doesn't even give a shit about it, you know? Like, she's just like, yeah, it was so fun. We poked it with a stick. It was cool. It's all a dead body part. A uh, dead freaking, a freaking dismembered limb. Like, what the hell? Like... Shouldn't you be, like, more worried and more frightened and, like, you know, wanting to, like, try to figure out what's going on? Instead of, like, poking that shit and, like, saying, whoa, it was so cool. Wow, it's been literally 36 hours since I've been online? This shall not stand? What the hell? Ah, uh, no. What is wrong with you? Dang, she got all these pop-ups, damn it. Man, look at these pop-ups right now. Hot chat live right now? Burly singles in your zip code? What the hell? Yo. What kind of shit was May looking at, bro? She got all the viruses, man. Oh my god, this freaking perv. I bet Angus knows how to fix this. He's all computery, I think. But I can't let him see this. Yeah, you can't let no one see this. Fantastic yums. Where does he work again? He works at the video store. How do I get out of here? What the fuck? Jeez. May was... May was freaking... I don't even want to explain what she was doing, but holy crap, man. Oh, I've never liked this bird. Hey, hon. Yeah? Come say hi. Who is this? Mom? It is mom. Morning, mom. Nope, I'm mom 24 hours a day. Har har har. Also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, is he your little friend Greg's boyfriend? Big guy, kind of quiet. Yeah, that's him. I need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, do you even know Angus? Do you? Why did, why did she ask? Mom, we were in a band together, sorta, yeah. Oh, is the band back together? Yeah, we practiced last night. I don't think we're gonna even ever play, though. Hmm. Well, that sounds like fun, honey. Yeah, I guess. You don't sound too happy about it. Eh. Well, I want to find Angus. Have a good time, daughter. Thanks, 24-hour mom. Seven days a week. Let's finish all the dialogues. Got a call from your Aunt Molly. Uh, what did Aunt Mallcop want? What? What do you mean, what did she want? Sweetie, I, wish, I really wish you wouldn't call her that. She worked very hard to get where she is, and it's a dangerous job. Oh yeah, Possum Springs is so dangerous. Anyway, did she tell you about what about the severed arm we found? She did, in fact. Scary things. Yeah, I guess. Honey, I know this is home, but please be careful out there. I will, Mom. And come home before dark unless you're with somebody, at least until they figure out what happened. Okay. Thanks, sweetie. So something dark is going on in this town. So, honey, yeah? What did the arm look like? It was cut off, like, right above the elbow. Was there blood and stuff? A little bit, a little bit. I wonder whose arm it is. Well, should be pretty easy to spot. Yeah, haha. <laughs> hey, what happened to your arm? I dropped it by the diner. Here, sir, I found your arm. <clears throat> Thanks, I was afraid I'd never see it again. People don't always return arms when they find them. It's a real shame. It's a cold world. A cold, cold world, sweetie. Did... Did we just joke about someone potentially getting murdered? Okay. I'm not gonna lie. That just turned me off completely. We just had a... Who the fuck? Hey, you kid. Adult. So you're back, eh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Hold on, let me finish my thought. Did we just joke with our mom about potentially someone dying? 
Who the hell are the writers? Finji? Finji. You need better writers. You need better writers. Like, these jokes are so... They're not jokes. Like, that's, that's not something you joke about. Like, you don't joke about... Someone getting murdered unless... May is crazy, right? So, I, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just finish the game. The only way I'll truly be able to give a verdict of this game is when we if we finish it, because there's some sort of mystery going on, and it just bo it just blows my mind how our main character and we just had like they don't even we don't even care about it like we don't even care that someone potentially could have died, like the mom was like hey be careful don't don't walk out at, alone at nighttime and then, and then the next dialogue she's talking about joking about the dead like the dead person, like what? Didn't last long, eh? No, Mr. Penderson. You get a job yet? I've only been there for like 24 hours. Yes, I've been elected mayor. Yes, I've been elected mayor? Dude, what the f- I've only been back for like 24 hours. Soon, it'll be only a week. Then a month. Then your whole life. You're right, I have so much time left. No one's forgetting who you are and what you did, you know? Oh, and we're bringing up May's past. They may act like they have, but that's just small town polite right there. Is that what this is? Small town polite's all you got, kid. So watch it. Well, that was really interesting, but I need to go listen to my cells die. Wait, what? what is it? Pa? Pa? What the fuck? Who the hell is this old ass Mr. Penderson or something like that? What the hell? This guy's just talking about like no one's gonna forget what you did? So May might be crazy. This might be some Silent Hill type of shit going on. And then May is the freaking crazy one, you know? We can talk to Selmers again. What is it like? What's it like being back? Well, I just got home, so I was just like taking it all in. Feel like anything's changed? Uh, yeah, totally. Park store is gone. Got a snack falcon now. Food donkey's gone. Got a ham panther though. The Harleys are bigger now. Saw them running around before. Yeah, I babysit those little shits sometimes. Are they bad? They seem so nice. That's how they fool ya. You know, they steal things. What? They steal things. Holy crap, I was fooled. Okay. This is my property, but it's my street. You ain't changed since you was a kid. So maybe something very sinister is going on in this town. I'm not sure. We have to go to the um, video store. Did anything here change on the news board? Looks like nothing changed. Oh, there's someone here! Pale white tunnelfish. Easy to catch and so delish. That's good. Oh god, you were listening? Okay, that was it. That was lame. Alright, this guy doesn't like us. Oh, we got some new people here. Delicious pretzels. Oh, hello, May. Um, do I know you? I don't know if you remember me, Miss Rosa. Hmm, I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You were so small. I guess some things don't change, eh? How did you know Granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime, and I'll tell you all about him. Things you might not know. Alright, you've got my interest. Sweet, curious child. So we just gotta like event like you know after you know waiting a couple days just like stop by see if she has any new dialogues see if she you know will tell us more about our grandfather looks like the delinquents are gone the delinquents are gone we gotta go into video outpost to talk to Angus.
be nice, death chill, brain eaters. Can I help you? I don't think so. Can I help you? I don't think so. What? What? I thought this is where we were supposed to go. I thought Angus worked at the video outpost too. This guy's gone, the little rat guy. Telesoft. Trying to see if I can interact with anything. Okay, it looks like that. Wait, what? I'm confusion. I am very confusion. Let's talk to these guys again. Better take shelter. Here come the smelters. No use hiding smelters. We'll find you. Okay. Snack Falcon. We have a boarded up house over here. We are back at the diner. It looks like the arm's gone. What's over here? I just want my computer. I need the internet. It's more important than whatever's out there. I know, but I thought, like, where is this guy? I swear... We're supposed to go to the video store, but maybe he's at the Snack Falcon? Greg? What the hell is Greg going? What the hell does Greg got going on? That's what I'm saying. This dude's freaking, like, dumb, bro. Hey, May. Got cups on my ears. Wow. Why? Yeah, just why? I was thinking about how they have beaches in Bright Harbor. And then I was thinking about the ocean. Oh my god. And then I put cups on my ears, and it sounds like the ocean. Wow, dude, you took me on a journey. Speaking of, uh, nothing, I guess. Do you know where I could find Angus? At work, at the video store. What do you want Angus for? Got computer problems. Figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Wow. Cool dude, I'll catch you- Or, cool dude, I'll catch you later. Definitely, I'm so glad you're back. So that arm, huh? Jeez, yeah, what the hell? What do you think happened? I don't know. How does an arm end up on the sidewalk in Possum Springs? I mean, kind of cool, but creepy. And like, two doors down from our apartment? You live in Towny Century now? Center now? Yeah, we live uh, next door. Huh, man, you have been away for a long time. I have. You up for hanging out later? So much to catch up on. No, I got dinner with the family. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? A friendly thing. Is it 6 o'clock yet? Is it 6 o'clock? Okay, that's all the dialogues. So finally, we we seem to have finally a normal conversation about the arm where, you know, everyone's reacting how they should be reacting, like frightened and worried and horrified, as opposed to like nonchalant and like just like so happy, go lucky about it. Like, what the hell? That was so weird. So yeah, I'm gonna, like, us joking about the arm, us joking about the dismembered, severed arm with our mom was crazy to me, bro. Like, it literally happened, like, less than 24 hours ago, and we're joking about someone potentially who got murdered with our mom. Like, what? That is not good writing. That is not good writing, I'm sorry. Can I help you? Where's Angus? Oh, he works day shift? Is It is day. I got here early? Wait, why does everything you say sound like a question? You do the same thing? I just didn't comment on it? Really? Yeah? Huh? What? <laughs> Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day until my mom gets back from work? Ew, babies. Pretty cool job, though. Uh, get to watch movies, eat candy, and meet cute guys. Ew, cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know, cute guys are overrated. That's cap. That's cap, bro. Because I'm going to introduce an ugly-ass guy to May, and she's going to be like, nah, I'll pass. She will not say cute guys are overrated then. That is cap. Big cappers. 
Oh, we, what the, we can go inside here. Huh? Is this Greg's house? What the heck? Okay, so something opened up. We can't we can't take the stairs? Huh? Let, let me see. Let me see if um uh, Greg has anything to say. Let me see if Greg has anything to say. Maybe not. Yeah, he doesn't. All right, let's go into that. Let's go into that um apartment complex. So the the um the worker, the employee at the um, video outpost. I don't know what this this person was going on about, and I can't tell who's a guy or a girl. I can't tell who's a guy or a girl because no one has voice, and if they're they're animals. We're all yeah, they're animals, so it's like I don't know who's guy or girl. I don't know. Let me see how long we've been going for though. Hold on. All right, guys, we've been going for an hour or so. Let's go for a little bit longer. Let's go for a little bit longer. I'm actually kind of enjoying this game. The only thing that's really throwing me off here is the right the writing in certain situations. It. It really is like very questionably bad. And it's very bad sometimes. What? There's no button. Hmm, there's gotta be some way to make this work. Click. Hello? 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 You're not Angus. Who's this? Who are you? May Borowski. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello? Click. Click. Mm, yes. Uh, hi, Angus. Angus, you say? Dude, it's May. Tell me about yourself, Maybelline. This isn't Angus. Would you like it to be? Nope. Bye. Click, click, click. Maurice? May. Angus? May? Yeah. You're not Angus. And you ain't Maurice. Well, I'm glad we worked that out. Click, hello, Angus? Are you searching, my child? Yeah, for Angus. You can search all you like for Ang your Angus. Everyone has a different Angus. For some, Angus is a happy marriage. For some, a good career. For some, a fancy car. My Angus is a guy named Angus, lives here. My child, no Angus will ever compare to the one true Angus, the Lord God above. Okay. Dear, have you encountered God this day? Man, what is this Jehovah's Witness ass? Man, get out of my face, bro. Look, my mom works at the church. I'm in the club by default. Click. Hello? 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 I'm looking for Angus. Any idea where Angus lives? I believe he is at number two. Written on the button, I think. It looks, uh, broken. I think the little guy he lives with kicked it in. Greg? Or something. How? Uh, beats me, kid. I just live here. Click. So they destroyed the button? We need to find the button. Oh. Nope. Didn't want to go in here just yet. Wait, okay, I, I guess we can't go in here? We do have a new place that lot opened up, but we need to find, like, a button. He works night shift, so we have to, you know, figure out a way to make it nighttime. We can't go in the diner. Do we have to just go to sleep, I guess? Let me see this. Do we have anything here? Nope. I don't think there's anything in this snack falcon. Let's check one more time. I don't think there's anything in here though. And this guy is this guy is a like freaking This guy is just freaking like a freaking idiot, man. I don't even want to talk to him. I don't even want to talk to this guy. So we need to find some button in order to go up to Angus uh, to get our computer fixed, but we need to find the button for it. Or we need to use the elevator to find Angus, but we need a button. I don't know where I'm supposed to find a button. Does she have new dialogue? Nope. This 
guy's fishing still. He didn't catch anything. Da -da 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 -da. No, we can't go in here. It says we're open, but we can't go in there. Maybe I maybe it, maybe we were supposed to go inside the building. I'm just missing something, but I don't know There's no like objective list either so we can't really like figure out what to do Through like a menu so um, we just we're just like on our own here. Is it this? Oh do we have to use the um the ball? There's also this missing person, Casey, here that was mentioned, um, you know, by the, our band members. They said that, he, um, our band members said that he moved, but... Like, is he missing really, or is he, did he just move? There's no way this button that we need to find is in our house, like, you know, is mom home? No one's home. So it's gotta be in that apartment complex, but where? Where though? Maybe we have to go to sleep? Oh hell no! Nah. Get this freaking corn hub out of here! Holy shit! Nah, we're we're playing base later. The hell? So we can't go to sleep to like you know progress through the day to go nighttime. What's going on? Go on the wires. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Works. We're doing stuff here. What's this? Oh, wow. Look at this, guys. Oh, there's a little acorn up here. You guys seeing that? Oh, look at that, the acorn flew off. That's cool. Ghosts? What? Press... Woo! What the heck? What am I, what am I supposed to do? Confusion, I'm confusion right now. Oh, shoot! Click. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. Hello? Ah, who is this? Yeah, hi, it's May. May? Yeah, May. I, I just got electrocuted. Oh, yeah, it's fiddly. There's no button. Yeah, you can, like, stick a screwdriver in, and, well, it's not... Well, it's too late now. Wow, just stick a screwdriver in? What the heck? All right, we finally got access. Jesus Christ. Finally, we can go talk to Angus. Tell him to freaking fix our freaking corn filled, freaking porn filled freaking laptop. Freaking maze horn dog ass. Jesus. Alright. So here's Angus. Wow, he's got a nice place. Really nice place. Alright, Angus, this is pretty embarrassing. Um, so please don't judge me. Uh, my computer has a bunch of viruses. 
Come right in. Hey, dude. Um, welcome to our apartment. I could have been in my underwear. What? Hey, dude, don't wear pants on my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg's at work if you're looking for Greg. Oh, we've... We've seen Greg. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up, and I thought... What's wrong with it? Uh, lots of things pop up when it when I turn it on. What kind? What kinds of things? You know, things about things, not for kid kids things. We'll go with this one. Why didn't you bring it with you? I forgot it. Hmm. You know, May. You don't like have to be embarrassed about. I'm not. I mean, everyone. I know. Mm, let me see what I can do. Yeah, freaking. Angus is about to freaking put my ass on blast. Pause. Okay, I got something for you. Plug this into any USB port and restart. It should clear you right up. It might delete some of your old files, though. Wow, thanks, dude. No problem. Gonna head on home. See you if you... Oh, I didn't read it. Whoops. It's not magic. It's just ones and zeros. And we're just atoms, and our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away, and poof, there goes the universe. Alright, freaking Shakespeare. Freaking Confucius, mother effer. Alright, freaking Gandhi. Relax, guy. Yeah, exactly. Dot, dot, dot. What is this guy talking about? Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm going. I mean, these people are weird. Oh, we just uh, fast-traveled back home. Angus. Alright, Pops, what's the word? Hey, Dadders. Why, if it isn't the mayor of Possum Springs herself. What did you get up to today? Hung out with Angus a bit. You remember him. Oh, yeah, I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they fell on some hard times after we all got laid off. Whoa. Used to see him at the bar. Yeah. After I stopped drinking, I didn't really see him as much. I wonder how he is. Did they find anything about anything out about that arm? Not that I heard. Uh, well, be careful out there. Maybe I should carry mace or brass knuckles or something. Well, it'd be a shame if you got into trouble and were unarmed. No, I think I'd, I'll be okay. Dot, dot, dot. What? Dot, dot, dot. Haha, <laughs> okay, I get it. Unarmed, eh? Oh my god. Oh my god, they really, dude, they really snuck this joke in there, really, unarmed, oh my god, they really, they are, these guys don't hold back their punches, literally someone could be freaking murdered, alright, by a psychopath Jeffrey Dahmer motherfucker, and we're freaking, we're freaking, we're in the freaking laugh factory right now. What the hell is going on? Unarmed? Really? Come on, man. I'm going to bed now. Good night, Mayor Kitten. Good night. That's the last dialogue. All right. Well, I guess I'll, I'll give him that. That one was a pretty good one. That one was a pretty good one. Still, like, extremely too... Like, it's just happening too soon, man. Like, come on, guy. Like, someone could be dead. Alright, let's fix our computer, though. Let's see if this Angus fix works. Can't get any worse, at least. I guess it could be on fire? Anyway. OMG, it's fixed! I guess it turned out okay, then. Your computer? Yeah, it did, thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Demon Tower? Yo, chill. What's going on? Oh, yeah, I used to play that all the time, like, ten years ago. Yeah, definitely played Demon Tower, for sure. I've been playing again. They've kept uh, updating it. You can grab your old save game from their server and start right where you left off. Oh, cool. You should check it out when we can talk. Uh, you should check it out, and we can talk Demon Tower sometime. It's really cool still. I am deaf doing this. Oh, thanks, Angus. Tips hat. Hey, you get that porn off your laptop. <laughs> okay, yeah. Just getting right, cutting the bullshit. You know, getting straight to the freaking meat and potatoes. Jeez. I heard you broke it with so much porn. I did not. 
Dude, you know it. You know, we'll just fess up. Rick Wreckage told me that before the internet, they'd hide porn in a hollow log in a hollow log in the woods. Yeah, that was a thing, right? Be awkward if you were hiking out to the porn and some dude was already there and you're like, sup dude, I guess we're both here for the porn? What? I bet that happened, you know. I bet that happened, you know it did. I bet they became friends, oh hell nah. Porn log bros forever? Dude, bruh. I'm about to uninstall this game right now. What am I playing? What did I just sign up for? Finji Studios? What the hell? Man, porn log bro. Porn log bros forever. Are we about to hashtag this shit? Are we about to hashtag this shit? So, dude, you're coming to the party tomorrow night, right? What party? Up in the state forest. Lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people, the big fire, the snacks, the beers. <laughs> Girl, you know I will. Did you mean to write snacks or snakes? I'll just say we'll be there. Girl, I'm so excited. Woods are so fun at night. Oh, and that's the title card. Night in the woods. And then whoever this character, the yellow character is. I think the yellow character is Greg. Wait, is Greg a, a female? What the hell? I'm going to get so wasted. So Greg said, um, night in the woods is fun. Or, like, it gets fun at nighttime. I'm gonna get so wasted. There are no laws in the woods. Oh, hell no, nah, man. What kind of freaking cult activity, freaking conjuring type freaking ish is going on? Cool. Well, you should ask B if she can drive us. What? No, I don't think she likes me. No, nah, dude, she's cool. She drives us all the time and lets us borrow her car. Stop by her store tomorrow and ask, okay, please? Okay, whatever, so we gotta, yay. So we gotta go to the old pickaxe. So here we have a little um, pizza as our mouse cursor. That's pretty cool. Bright Harbor Gazette, Secretary of Education. Having public schools is like having public hamburgers. That's insane, everyone should buy their own hamburgers. Uh, I don't really agree with that. <laughs> What's this? We just have like these icons on the right. Away message, born to lose, country trash proud drummer, skate and destroy, skate and create, bound for glory. <laughs> what the hell, you guys seen this little shark at the bottom? Hi. 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 <laughs> Let's play Demon Tower. In the age of blood, a pale one will rise. Wielding not but a simple blade, who dares to climb the steps of... Demon Tower! Ancient Doom Spire, Demon Tower. Part 5, I think? Or part four, Slaughter of the Blood Thief? What is this, like some Streets of Rage? Oh, okay, here we go. X is the dash. Oh, shoot. Oh, nice. Okay. Is there any other buttons we could press? It's just C and X. This, like, reminds me of, like, the old school Zelda games, you know? Like, A Link to the Past or whatever, I think that's what it's called. Like, for the Game Boy Advanced and shit. Giving me those vibes. Looks like we have like a life bar to the top left.
We have like a dash. There's like these purple, oh, oh, there's like these pink flames. I'm not sure what they do. Ow. That hurt. Okay. So in case you're bored of the game, you know, and you wanna you just have like a little, you know, Legend of Zelda kind of vibe, ow. Then, you know, check out Demon Tower, my friends. It's pretty chill. I wish there was like more abilities or more intricacies to my, to the game, but it's okay. Okay, this is good. There was like a door up there. I think we cleared mostly everything. Oh, here we go. Press X on it. Is this like a boss? Oh, we get a key. Oh, okay, and this key leads to that uh, room up there, probably. Oh, we got a boss! Oh, this is cool. What? Did he just get one shot? What the hell, bro? That was it. That wasn't a boss. Level 11, the seller. Oh, wait, was I supposed to kill him? I don't think I was supposed to kill him. Whoops. It looks like it gets a little bit more harder as you, you know, go up the demon tower. I don't think I was supposed to kill that guy. I think he was like an ally. But, you know what? It is what it is. It happened. That was a lame boss fight though, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, now we have two sprints now. You see our gauge in the top left? We have two yellow or two blue ones. Ow! Oh, that hurts. Okay, let's just try to do this next level and then we'll um, end the game. We'll go to sleep and then we'll end the video, I mean. I don't know if we were supposed to kill that guy in the beginning. I think we effed up there. I like the music though. Music's nice. We have another little pathway. Let's clear this whole entire room first. Oh shoot. Ow, ow, ow. I didn't mean to. Ow, I'm, go I'm goofing up here. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Alright, I think we've cleared this room. Oh, nope, we got a couple more. A couple more ghosty guys here. Ah, here we go. This is pretty neat though. I do like this. I can get like addicted to this, you know? Just keep on climbing the towers. We got another key to go to the next room. I'm assuming it is over here. Ow. Ow. Keep getting hit by that. Okay, probably get the key from here. Let's get out of here, fight another boss. Hopefully we don't one-shot the boss. I mean, kind of want a little bit of a challenge, you know? Don't want it to be that easy. All right, so here we go. We made it to level, the next level. Oh, okay, he didn't die from one shot. This is cool. Okay, here we go. Oh, he's got like a, like a, like a Santa sack on him. He's attacking us with a Santa sack. It's kind of weird. Pretty easy though, he doesn't move. We just kite him a little bit. Dodge his attacks like that. Hey, okay. We're having our, old, our own little Demon Souls battle right here. 
Dark Souls Elden Ring battle right here. You seeing this? Oh. Oh, dodge your ass. Got him. Oh, he got us there. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, I'm sorry. Didn't mean it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, he's... Oh, my God. He's getting kind of scary now. Chill. Relax on, relax on me, gang. There we go. Got his ass. Did we get anything? No, we just go to the next level. We're just climbing the demon tower. I don't know how many levels this has. Level 111. Skelly outskirts. Dun, dun, dun. Why are we, like, slow? Can't slash him over the river? There we go. Yeah, we can. We have three dashes now. So we can just start, like, speed running this a little bit. Okay, looks like we have some booby traps on the ground here. We have new enemy types. We have armored soldiers. Takes three hits. Okay. We'll do this next level and then we'll end the game. Because I'm kind of like... I, I kind of like this kind of game, you know? I could get addicted to this, you know? Kind of reminds me of those Game Boy Advance games, you know? Back in the day. Alright, so we have the uh, door to the next boss. Just gotta find the key. Ow. Ow. Oh my god, we're, we're getting hurt. We're getting beat up. For some reason, we can't get max health. Like, our that shield over there is, like, broken. On the top left side, it's like busted up, and we can't like he we can't regen that, which is very suckish. Here's the um room. Yeah, we got some freaking Luigi's Mansion freaking mother effers up in this mother effer. I don't even get my ass. Oh shoot. This one was a fast one. We'll speed run with this one. We don't really need to clear the rooms, right? We just need to get the key as fast as possible. Unless we want to, like, experience the whole map and stuff, but, eh, kind of good on that, you know? Any heals, though? Let's do this one. Let's end. And I think we could save our progress. To oh, shoot. This dude's got the freaking Satan summoning circle. Yo, chill, gang. Yo, chill, gang. He got that freaking Satan summoning circle up on that ish. Oh, what the hell? Ah. Ow. Okay. So he summons a lot of ads. While moving in the freaking pentagram head ass freaking shape. Along the map, we gotta get him when he's when he uh, stands still. But there's a lot of ads coming in. We could have hit him there. Ah, dang it! Oh, dang! We're kind of running low on health. We gotta be very careful. I'm just gonna uh, play it slow. We just gotta play it slow. Cause he doesn't like a, he doesn't hit me with like an ability or anything. Oh shoot! He just um summons ads. So we can just play this slow and then be good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, uh, we're getting really weak, guys. There we go, right there. That's a good hit. Oh. Yeah, we gotta watch out for... Uh, we can't be on his freaking... His LOS either. We can't be on the path of the, his freaking... Wherever he's going, this freaking pentagram head ass, freaking thrasher head ass. Oh shit, yo, these things are getting like really. Oh my, oh dang, he got me there. Oh, he's moving. Oh, he's schmoving. Yo, dude is schmoving, bro. Holy, we almost got hit there. Oh, he's schmoving, bro. Oh. Yo, we're about to die. I'm about to die.
There we go. We gotta go ahead. He's almost dead, though. We're about to die, and he's about to die. Come on. Uh, oh my god, there's a health. It's like in the freaking line of the pentagram shit, so I, I'm scared. I'm scared he's gonna run into me and kill me. Oh shit. I forgot we have a dash. Oh! That was a lucky hit. Oh my god. Holy shiba. Oh, look at that. Oh my god. Oh no, no, no. No! Dude, look at his HP bar, bro. Look at his HP bar. Dude, I kind of like this kind of game. Wait, do we have to restart from the beginning? We all we do. Okay, let, let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. Hold on, let's find him one more time. Wait, is this the same level? What the hell? I don't think it is. Oh shit, we're stuck. I don't think this is the same level. This has to be level one, right? Ow. 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 Yo, chill. Holy yo. Okay, this is... Because, like, you can't spam the sword slash. There's, like, a delay. Like, I'm spamming sword slash, so it's not just, like, out. It's not as easy as just, like, you know... Just, you know, just kill them, you know? It's not that easy. You have to, like, kind of time your attacks and shit. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, surrender to the horror? Yes. Let's get out of here. That was actually pretty fun. How do you, how do you get out of here? V? Okay. Ooh, that was fun. Demon Tower. Cool. Alright, let's, uh, let's go to bed. Bedtime? Yes. Alright, so it's the next day. We're gonna go to a party tomorrow in the in the woods at nighttime. That's what the title of this game is called. So things might get a little crazy. Things might get a little crazy tomorrow. Alright, well we'll just end it here. Um yeah. Alright guys. Let me, I'm gonna, I wanna get rid of this, I wanna get the music out of my ears. But alright guys, let's end today's video. If you guys are still here watching, thank you guys a bunch. I appreciate you guys. I am gonna be completing Fears to Fathom for those of you guys who wanna see me scream like a little bitch, alright? We're gonna be playing that after we finish Night in the Woods. I'm very conflicted about this game though. There have been points in my playthrough so far... I just wanted to uninstall the game because it was just it, this game just does not seem that good. But then some parts it really does shine, so I'm like I'm confused how to feel about this game. That's why I kind of like want to reserve my judgment till the end, um, you know. But right off the bat, some of the dialogue in here is very very shocking. Like us joking or with our mom about someone who got murdered is like crazy to me dude like literally 24 hours less than 24 hours after it happened like that's crazy to me like and, and then finally like and, but then and, but like you know there's those certain situations and then you know there are some situations where may does feel like empathetic and worried about you know this situation and there are situations where the parents are, like you know Hey, be careful, you know, Possum Springs isn't like how it used to be, blah, blah, blah. It's like, it might be scary at nighttime or whatever, you know? But then all of a sudden, and then, but then they go to the, another dialogue of them, of them, like, freaking just lightheartedly joking about someone potentially getting murdered. I, I just don't know how to feel about that. Like, it's definitely not a good feeling. I'm just, like, sitting here like, what did I just hear? Like, what did I just watch? You know, but, um... Aside from those awkward dialogue moments, um, this game isn't bad. Um, we do have finally a conflict that is brought up, but not really the main focus. We have Casey Hartlett or whatever his name was. He's missing. Um, and then also we have the uh, severed arm that showed up in front of the uh, in front of um, May and the band outside of the diner. So very similar to Wolf Among Us, you know, dead body, severed, um, you know, body part, just 
propped up on some steps, you know, in front of like a building. So there's a similarity there, but um, yeah, like I said, I don't know how to feel about this game. So far, it's okay. You know, it's not bad. Like I said, some of the dialogue choices and the characters feel a little too cartoony, if that makes sense. Like, you know, Greg, for example, is just completely cartoony. Um, and it kind of doesn't make sense because these are all college students, right? Like, when I was in college, that's not how none of us were acting. That's how no college student was acting. That was how we were acting in high school and middle school, you know? So this story would have made more sense if we were in high school, middle school, middle school. Um, or not, not, not the story, excuse me, but the dialogue would make more sense if, you know, our characters were in high school and middle school. So that that's also a little confusing. Um, and also, you know, the whole town just not caring about like the whole town is just like super feral you know like there's just a i don't know i have a lot of questions i'm hoping that by the end of it everything gets answered because right now i don't really know what to think about this game it's okay um but yeah i think i'm gonna end this video so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys tomorrow all right i'm out peace